The first Shea locomotive was built in 1878 by a man named F.E.M. Shea. F.E.M. Shea was a logger and he wanted to make a locomotive that could go tight turns and up steep grades. His answer was to make a geared steam locomotive. But what is a geared steam locomotive? Well first, I'm going to show you what a non-geared steam locomotive is. As you can see, a rod engine is where all the rods are connected to the main driving wheels. Not all the wheels are powered, and the wheels stay rigid. Well, this is good for flat terrain and big corners. However, sharp corners and steep grades will make the rod engine weak for this job. It's only because the wheels will start spinning and start tearing up the rails and starting all sorts of problems. This is where a geared locomotive comes into play. A geared steam locomotive is an engine that uses gearing, mainly reduction gearing, as opposed to the drivetrain, unlike a rod engine. The gears make the locomotive go much slower than a rod engine. However, all the wheels are powered and the trucks are able to swivel and move around sharp corners and up steep grades and on poorly laid track. This was normally for logging operations. A Shea locomotive would have two or three sets of cylinders powering the two or three trucks. There was three or four types of Shays. There was class A locomotives which had two cylinders and two trucks. The class B had three cylinders and two trucks. A class C had three cylinders and three trucks and a class D had three cylinders and four trucks. In order to fit the cylinders on the right hand side of the locomotive, the boiler had to be offset so that there would be enough room for the three cylinders on the right hand side of the engine. And this gave the engines a odd looking appearance. The first Shea built by Lima was in 1880 and the last Shea was built in 1945 by Lima. In total, there was about 2,768 Shea locomotives built. Shea locomotives are not used just in America, but all over the world. Different railroads use Shea's, such as logging, mining, coal, even short line railroads. The Shea locomotives have been running for well over 100 years, but unfortunately, starting in the mid 1930s around World War II, the beginning of World War II, the Shea locomotives were starting to fade out on logging lines because logging trucks and vehicles were taking over. The last Shea locomotive in revenue service in America ran in 1973. Today, there's 115 Shays still in existence, and of those 115, a good dozen of them or more are still operational. Now, let's talk about our engine here. Mount Telempia Shea No. 4 is a 15-ton two-truck Shea built in 1903. She would haul tourist trains and logging trains for the Mount Telempia Railroad until 1930 when she was retired. A year later, Shea No. 4 was scrapped in 1931.